make my screen larger, but um, welcome to Let's Play Mario Super Circuit. Um, I had this game back in 2003 when I was 3 years old. I'm 13 now, it's been 10 years since I did this. Um, I didn't know what title to choose, so I just said, hey, let's do a quick game, because I'm only going to spend a week here. Um, and well, we got... Wow, you know, it really reminds me how much Mario Kart changed. You know, nowadays you can just get a 3DS and play Mario Kart 7, but back in the early 2000s, you just had a Game Boy Advance. You had to get Mario Kart so Super Circuit. Alright, so I agree. We should get started. So, whenever it does it, which is probably going to be. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> There's the Ghost Exchange, thanks to the Link Cable, and you get multiplayer. And also, unlike other games, it has a single cartridge. And you, I don't know, it's like DS download play. Like you have one DS with the game, and other DS can play. It was like that, but with the link cable. So we should get started. There was Mario GP, Mario Grand Prix, Time Trials, and there was also a quick run, which is basically just one single race. And it was 50 CC. You know, and you know all this about Mario Kart. But I'm gonna do 100 CC because it's a more like a balanced thing. So of course we got Mario. Luigi, Peach, we also got Toad, we got Don we got DK, Donkey Kong, we got Wario, and we also got Bowser, and we also have Yoshi. Well, I'm gonna be using Yoshi. And everybody has their little classic sound effects. We're also gonna be doing the Mushroom Cup with Flower Cup, Mario Circuit, Blue Lake, Cheese Land, and something else. Luigi Circuit, Sky Garden, Cheap Cheap Isle, Sunset Wilds. Snowland, Ribbon Road, Yoshi Desert, and Bowser Castle 3. And well, we don't know what this one is, but we obviously know it has Rainbow Road on it. <laughs> I mean, think every Mario Kart game has Rainbow Road. Oh yeah, and Bowser Castle 2. And now we're going to do the Mushroom Cup, Peach Circuit, Shy Guy Beach, Riverside Park, Bowser's Castle 1. Okay, I'm going to get the rocket started this time. I know I am. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Yes. Oh my gosh. Man, I be... Because I'm playing this on my phone, so like... Also, I'll enter in the um, links on how you can get it on your um, phone. This goes for iPhones. I don't know Android and all that, but iPhones, yeah. I'm um, also... Man... Cause I, cause I swear I be getting the rocket star all the time. Besides from that, we got our regular items from Super Mario Kart and Mario Kart 64, which was the last game on Nintendo 64. This game came out in 2001. I know that. Also, we got the um the only item we don't have still. Sorry, that's the printer. The only item that we don't have still is um the feather. And, you know, the feather would turn Mario into Cape Mario. So, also the um, soundtrack is pretty good of this game. Um, I'm not really going to be like telling you, informing you on a bunch of stuff. I'm just going to tell you opinions of what I think of this game. Um, actually, I think it. I ain't going to say it's the best Mario Kart portable because I hadn't really fully tried Mario Kart 7. The only time I really tried Mario Kart 7 was probably when it was at Target on display. But with that, we finished the race with me and first of course you know it works like any other Mario Kart except this time who's ever in fifth place and below will be tied alright so we're gonna get started with our next race Shy Guy Beach Shy Guy Beach later gets remake remade in um, Mario Kart Wii an amazing soundtrack so listen to it If you heard some static, so my my hand was covering it.
Ace's soundtrack. Alright, um, so, I stay getting, you know what, and actually, there's not as much items now, because, you know, nowadays we got Mario Kart 8, which I also got, and yes, I hit Luigi with the green shell. Alright, let's get going. Um, also, another thing about this game is, that, of course, as any Mario Kart game is, you got four tracks, you know, four tracks, you know, each cup. And also, in Mario Kart 64, I believe, I think that was the first game to show 150cc. Well, I don't care which one was the first. But with that, we finished Shy Guy Beach. And also, um, I believe that, um, yeah, Super Mario Kart, it was only 50cc or 100cc. It was not 150cc. And you only had three cups. The um, Mushroom, Flower, and Special Cup. And this one, you actually have four. And well, oh, right now we're at DK Jungle. And one thing I will always say about Mario Kart is they do a great job with the DK or slash jungle levels. I mean, I loved Mario Kart 8. Well, recently Mario Kart 8. Um, they remade DK Jungle, which is off the 3DS version, Mario Kart 7. And I never played Mario Kart 7 like that, like I said. I think the only track I played was probably Mario Circuit. Um, but yeah, I was like, I was like, oh wow, really? Also, if you turn too hard in this game, you somehow your car just stops working and spins out. I don't know. Like, but yeah, I mean, I feel like Nintendo does a great job with the um, jungle levels. Um, there was DK Jungle Park way in the Mario Kart 64. Um, with, oh man, that level was great too. And that, that was remade in the Mario Kart Wii. Um, I think Mario. I don't think Mario Kart Wii had any jungle levels. I can't really remember. I can only remember the levels that were remade in the Mario Kart Wii U, Mario Kart 8. Um, well, this isn't Mario Kart 8, so let me stop talking about that game. Because I've been playing that recently. Um, I have this on my phone, and like, whenever I'm on the go or something, and I'm listening to music, I'll just play this. You know, so I have recently touched it. I'm just saying, it's been a while since I did a full playthrough. Because, you know... Not a bunch of people beat games on emulators, you know. I'm sorry if you hear background noise, it's just people talking, you know, business. Alright, make that sharp turn. Swerving, swerving. Alright, cutting through the grass. Oh, yeah, also, I mean, I'm happy that they introduced car customization, but I always like the, the pipe frame, which is basically this cart. And with that, I throw that green shell. Green shell hit the boulder. Almost, it almost hit Luigi. You know, there goes everybody else chilling. They coming in. Mario's actually in fourth now. So it was in fifth. Alright, let's see here. And with that, we're already at the last lap. Yep, in eight minutes, we're already. Eight minutes and 17 seconds, we're already in the last lap. And I still don't get the rocket started. Alright, now Bowser Castle, one thing that messed me up was that hinge. And there's a bunch of them. That caused Peachy Goat insane on me. And then she somehow hit me, and my banana hits Wario from passing me. I passed Toad, so he passed me back. Okay, so I'm like, right now, I'm like, really? But then I'm gonna use the mushroom. I'm gonna clean pass it. Ooh, clean pass it. See? Got a hinge. I'm telling you. That hinge is the most annoying thing ever. That corner. I don't know what to call it. Okay, so I try to throw my green shells. Well, not yet. I hate them things, man. Them things gonna fall. They, they always fall when you're, like, messing up. I don't know. What I'm saying. I tried to throw a green show, I failed. Um, but one thing was, I remember... I remember the first time I played this, I played this Mario, of course. And, like, Mario, I ain't gonna lie. I mean, Mario is a good character. He's balanced like Luigi and everything. But, I mean, he kind of sucks in a way. And what I mean, he kind of sucks is, like... Whenever I try to turn, he doesn't turn hard enough, so I had to use Yoshi. But I sadly get a third. Don't worry, but next time I won't lose. Because at first I was like, wow, this is so easy. These um tracks are pretty short. And I mean, that's because it's a Game Boy game, so you can't stuff as much level development as if it was on a console, home console. And this is what it looks like when you win the Grand Prix. Um, I ain't gonna say it's lazy. I mean, it seems lazy, you know. Just drop the big, you know, the, the big stand, and, you know, your car's just jumped on it. Yeah, big fish walks, but I don't even know. And then your trophy looks like the color that you got it from. Um, but yeah, 
and it distinguishes your rank, you know, how much coins you see. Also, my um, screen capture only record up to 10 minutes and it got up. So, like, yeah.